Uh, I just thought of something not, um, not great. I'm not getting paid for this. What is it? I filed a report that said that neither of us ever talked to or saw those girls, the ones that went missing a few weeks back. Hmm. Uh. Yeah, I told you not to say anything. You agreed with me. I know I did. And now someone probably has a transcript of that entire conversation. <gasps> filed a report that's a blatant lie oh, and those girls are still missing yep wow yeah I didn't realize that fuck Delilah fuck indeed we really need to get to the bottom of this hmm I don't know how we're going to do that though like how are we going to break into the oh I do have that axe though I do have that fireman's axe I wonder if we can if that's able to break through the lock maybe I doubt it, but, uh, here's this thing. Uh, I haven't been through here in a while. Eh, I guess I can I kind of want to go through Thunder Canyon. Like, I'm, I'm kind of used to it. Kind of want to go through there. Is this, is this where I can go? Yeah, I, okay, yeah. I don't know if I can climb that or, or, or just walk around it. Or what am I going to do with this? Oh, clear it with the axe. Ha <laughs> ha! Oh, yeah! I guess I could use the axe to clear that uh, that one that, that was all the way back there, but I just guess I got the axe afterward. Yeah, I got the axe afterward. Then I never went back there because I went the other way. Yeah, forgot about that. Well, anyways, yeah, I guess I cut down that tree and everything. So in the end, I did get to use the axe at least. So that's pretty cool. Let's go down here to Thunder Canyon, and let's uh, let's try to investigate what's what's going on with this 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 Wapiti Meadows, this Wapiti Station stuff. See what's going on with all this. Alright, well, we're getting pretty close to the lake. I think Wapiti Station slash Meadow is just over here. If I remember. Yeah, there's that cash box. So I think we just need to keep going this way. And then eventually we'll hit Wapiti Station. And figure out what is going on with this. this them, like, spying on us and stuff like that. And, uh, oh, yeah, we have to, like, go this way. God, I remember I got trapped here last time. Let's go over here. Let's see if we can find a Wapiti station. We have to go up here, I believe. Uh, yeah, okay, yeah, this is where we have to go. We have to go down this little thing. Yep, here it is right here. Gotta go down this. There's the floating Illuminati rocks. Just like bounce like it was nothing. And then up here should be that gate. And we can figure out uh, what is going on with this gate. Is he was hiding back there and... The fence is still here. Let's see if we can break down that, uh, that lock with our fireman's axe. I'm busting the gate down. There's nobody around, and it's the quickest way in. Copy that. Oh, nice. <sighs> Whoppity Meadow. Open the lid. Oh. Bees. Ow. Buzz, buzz. What's that? What's it? God, I just threw it on the ground. <laughs> Let's see, what is it? Whoppity Station personnel. If you're trying to reach Dr. Simmons, he is on site August 15th to October 15th. University-owned equipment. It's the responsibility of, doc responsibility of Dr. Johnson. Government-owned equipment is under the purview of Cat Ferdinand. Remember, this is a controlled area, and any issues, malfunctions, or violations will be reported immediately. Uh, uh, get rid of that garbage. Can I tell her about this? I'm on the inside. Oh, there's a bridge. Okay. Uh, uh. What's over here, though? Seems like a... Oh, that's just a rock that's like weirdly colored. Got my flashlight though. Forgot about this thing. I haven't had to use this thing like ever. That was a good time to use it with the sun setting. It's getting pretty dark. Investigating this spooky area. I don't know what to expect out here. But we are getting pretty close to... Solving whatever mystery this is. Oh... Some sort of radio tower? Okay, I'm at the site. I don't see anybody around. Lucky for us. Yeah, lucky for us. D, there is some serious comms equipment out here. Wireless stuff. What do you mean? I'm talking a big 20-foot tall transmission tower. I mean, they can probably listen to whoever the hell they want. They're nestled down in this valley, which makes it impossible for you or any lookout to see them. Hmm. 
What do we want to do about it, though? Can I, like, unplug the generator? Maybe? I guess not. Huh. What are you going to do? Oh, there's another thing over here. What is this? Oh, this looks more high-tech. Oh. It's a tent, though. Might want to stay a little bit far away from this. Top secret alien stuff, maybe? Ladder. Can't tell her about it. Is there someone inside there? I'm in their main tent. What's it like? It's definitely some sort of monitoring station. Hmm. This place sleeps three. They've got a row of cots here. So they live and work in the same tent? Yeah, it's all one operation. Huh, like us? Yeah, like us. I just I wonder where they are. All, all of their stuff is here. And they know you're there, so see what you can find and get out. I found their main monitoring desk. Oh my god, what do you see? Seriously, at this stage, I'd believe just about anything. A little transceiver. There's some sort of monitor. I don't know what it does. Maybe air quality or something? Maybe they're keeping data on everything that could impact our moods. There's a box here with a dial. It has a needle, like it measures earthquakes. You mean like a lie detector? Yeah, I'm not sticking around to get hooked up to it. Hmm. Okay. Shit. Got a map here that confirms they're tracking my... our... people's movements. The map's got all sorts of paths and areas marked off on it. There are lines that look like some of the paths I normally take. Are you positive it's you? I'm not sure, but I think so. Hmm. Okay, so there's a log here that tracks the movement of four distinct subjects. You and me? Uh, yeah, definitely me. And I suppose you too. What about the other two? Hmm. Yeah, they might be the good ones. Maybe the good ones? What if they were following them last summer? God, Henry, I don't know. If they were, there's no way Brian knew. He would have said something. Yeah, I can't imagine a kid like that could have kept this under his hat. We'll talk this over and figure out how to get the hell out of here. Hmm. Pick up that mug. Throw it. What's that? I l you love Wyoming? Huh. Throw that on their cot. What are we... Uh, shelf of food. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff. Let's drop this Biff. <laughs> Biff peanut butter. There you go. Shelf of food. Got some jam. Throw that too. Oh, what is this? Ah! <gasps> Wave receiver. What in the world? Uh. Follow the beeping device. I mean, there's all sorts of contraptions and shit out here. This equipment is not stuff from the hardware store. Uh, okay, this thing is losing its mind, beeping like crazy. I can hear it. What, what's it after? I don't know. I'm gonna go find out. It was beeping more over here. Now oh, they're doing something with the soil out here, too. It's all gridded off. What else they're up to? Oh. Oh. I mean, this stuff looks like it just got lifted out of the space shuttle. I have to tell you, if I found out this was NASA, I'd be a hell of a lot happier. <laughs> I don't know what to say. This thing's going crazy now. They're measuring the barometric pressure, too. Why? Maybe it's just a diversion. Hmm. I, I think this thing is responding to something in this pile of crap on the desk. Dig through it. All right. <gasps> What's that? Tracking device? That's me. Folder of reports here. What do they say? They're assessments about the two of us. 
There's stuff in here about Julia. Like what? Stuff I didn't tell you. This is... What, what does it say about me? You said there was one about me. And it looks like they've been following me around. What I do when I'm out hiking? Jesus! Henry, do you hear me? Since you, you and your boyfriend are still together. What? We're not. They're messing with us. Yeah. Okay. They are. How do they even know who he is? How the hell does this... I'm so sick of letting these people do this to us. We should just burn the place down. <gasps> Let's do it. Think about it. Yeah. Fuck them. They'll dump an ocean of water on it, and these assholes will spend the rest of the summer picking up the pieces. We get to finish out our contracts. <laughs> Hell, we'll even call in the fire. Huh. <laughs> Savage. Yeah, okay. You don't sound too excited about that. I'm not. Look, worst case scenario... Hmm. I guess the forest burns down. The whole forest burns down along with whoever's in it? <sighs> Yeah. Worst case. Well, maybe it's not the best idea. Yeah, it's definitely not the best idea. <laughs> oh, I'm so fucking wound up. It's all right. I'm just going to hike back. We have the wave receiver, and tomorrow we can figure out what to do. All right, well, let's head back to Two Forks. I bet we're going to run into someone or something along the way back. And they're gonna wonder like, why do you have, why do you have that wave receiver? Why do you have all this stuff? Why do you, why do you steal that tracking device from us, Hata? And I'll be like, I don't know. I don't even know who you are, but you know who I am apparently. You know more about me than Delilah even knows apparently. So let's get out of here. Skiddly don dad loud and out of here. <laughs> and uh, oh, is this? Oh yeah, here's the bridge. I have to jump across it. There you go. Oh, oh, oh. Whoa. Man, how did I survive oh, that? Shit. Jeez. What was that? Call him smoke. What the? Uh, Delilah, there's smoke coming from the site. I, mean, I just climbed out of there and the bridge collapsed. Uh. What the hell happened to you? It's definitely not the best idea. It wasn't me. <sighs> what do we do? I don't know. Call it in. Just call it in like any other fire. And what about who started it? What about them? Uh, the person who started it? Yeah. We're talking about people watching us out here who are now burning the forest and everything in it around us. I, I, I don't know what to do about that. Except get the hell out. Yes, get us the hell out of here. I will. Day 77. The flapjack fire's still out there. Nice. <laughs> and to use the wave receiver. Why would I need to use this? Like, I already know where the, the tracking device is. This receiver just picked something up. Uh, what? What thingy? What now? I found a device that picks up frequencies. It's how I found the reports last night, and it's going off now. It just picked up a fre frequency? Yeah, what could it be? I don't know. You gotta find out. Alright, I'm on my way now. You know what I just picked up? Uh, no. Alcohol. A fifth of Major Bueno tequila from the creek. <laughs> Are you drunk? No! I am getting drunk! <laughs> hey D, I don't want to harsh your vibe, but maybe, just maybe, that's a bad idea. Henry, Henry, Henry. What? You're harsh in my vibe. My thinking is, I could stay up all night worried I'm going to lose my job because of the side fire, or... I could not worry, and let the chips fall where they may. It's not like there's any proof we were down there. My thinking is I'm gonna follow this wave receiver. Ooh, I like it when you think. ay ay ay. I'll just leave you alone with whatever these mm. thoughts are. Oh, it's getting... It's getting, really getting a pretty good signal there. Yeah, it's definitely picking something up now. Oh, gap in the bush. Let's clear that out. Something back here. Someone. <gasps> Strange backpack. Shit. Oh. What? Oh, the... oh, that was a bomb. Jeez. Some keys. <gasps> Did 
That opens up K4 to fit you out. Hey, that's pretty good. Alright. Well, let's report that back. Hey, I, I found some sort of supply bag, light camping gear, some clothes, you know, basics. But it was alarmed. I think that's what was making the receiver go haywire. You're okay? It's not a trap or anything? Yeah, I'm fine. But there's, there's also a set of keys here. I don't know why they'd be hidden out here. They say Shoshone National Forest, Cave 452. Is that the one in the canyon? Yeah, it is. <sighs> Who the hell took them? And what the hell is in that cave? Okay, okay, let's just think. Says the woman with a half a bottle of tequila in her belly. Maybe they're panicking and we're preparing to beat it. The fire has them spooked and we have new walkie-talkies, so we have the upper hand. Yeah, well, it's hard to feel like you have the upper hand when you're standing in the dark in the middle of the woods. Oh. Well, you're back in your tower. Maybe you need a drink, too. I'm not in my tower. I am looking at a man standing in your lookout. And it's not you? It is not me. Oh my uh, god, go. I'm going. Oh man, there is someone at my tower right there. Who, who could it be, though? I, I don't see anyone up there. Gotta get my fireman's axe out, just in case anything happens. Oh man. There's someone- oh. Are they still here? There's no one here. I don't see anyone up here. He was just there. Uh... Doesn't look like he's hiding. I don't see anyone still. No one there. The propane. Hmm. That's awfully weird. Let's go inside. Let's go invest. Oh. Taped Walkman. Uh, are you giving me some music? Why am I just wearing... drama throw it out the window it's a tape of us talking down at the site it sounds like it was recorded from somewhere nearby oh jesus yeah and it sounds like we were the ones who burned it down and that it was your idea no we are screwed no D, just don't freak out okay don't freak out oh my god what the fuck is happening henry <gasps> Day 78. What's wrong? What's wrong? Someone claiming to be Henry in Two Forks called a lookout in another sector early this morning and said that I knew what caused the Wapiti Meadow fire. Um... So, I just got off the horn with that lookout who's wondering what I know, or that I'm an arsonist, or that I'm fucking losing it. Furthermore, I bet you don't have the only tape of us from last night, so someone has evidence to back it up. We need to find out what someone's been keeping in that cave. I'm going down there now. We don't have a lot of time left out here, and if we don't find some fucking answers, when they lift us out of here, it's gonna be in handcuffs. Alright, well... Us? Yeah, stick together. We just, we have to stick together. Okay? Keep our story straight. From the first day with those girls to the person breaking in on our conversation, everything. We just, we gotta be honest and consistent. Yeah. I suppose you're right. I know. Alright, let's go down that cave. Now we have the keys, we have everything we need. Figure out what the, what the hype is about that cave. What's over here? Is this... Is this how I get down? I don't I don't remember. It's been a while. Oh. Oh yeah, yeah, here it is right here. Forgot about this. Uh, ah, there you go. And drop down. Uh, ah, there you go. Nice. Alright, let's keep going down. Gotta go down in that cave. And I, I'm I'm really curious. Like, like who's doing this? Why are they doing it? And have they been doing it for a long time? And I assume they haven't, because she's acting like it's never like this is the first time it's ever happened. 
Sweet. Hey, oh. You. You didn't actually make that call, right? To, to the other lookout. It just stuck in my craw. I, I let myself imagine how fucked I would be if you'd been lying to me. But now that I asked, I kind of just wish I hadn't. Yeah, of course not. Of course I didn't. No way. They're just. They're trying to pit us against each other. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. That's not gonna happen, though. Thanks, Henry. Alright. Here it is. The moment of truth. Let's go in.